Chevy family. So I've been dreading doing this video, but I'm going to go ahead and do it anyway. I didn't want to slander nobody, but I'm just going to keep it all the way a buck about this car. Don't get me wrong, from a distance, it looked decent. If I was a rookie, it would be decent too, but I'm not a rookie. I've been in the car game too long to accept a bullshit-ass paint job. So I'm going to give you all the reasons why this car is being repainted. It was just painted, what, seven months ago? What, July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February. It was, it was painted seven months ago, right? And I'm already getting it repainted. And I spent like 3500 bucks on this paint job. So let me show you all the reasons why this car needs to be repainted. Why this is the paint job from hell. One, we're going to start in the front here. For one, look under the hood. Look at this up close. I'm going to show you all the good, bad, and the ugly. Look at that, man. This is supposed to be a candy paint job. But they say you get what you pay for. So for 3500 bucks, I guess I got what I paid for. Right? So don't be cheap, fellas. Don't be like Box Every P and be cheap. Pay that money and get this shit done right. But check it out, man. Y'all see that bullshit there, right? Look at there. He was supposed to paint under the hood. He never did that, right? That's one thing. He was supposed to paint inside of the hood. He never did that, right? Okay, he was supposed to paint inside of here. He never did that. Look at all this shit. It was supposed to be paint all up in there. He didn't paint none of that. And it's black paint. I just got the engine base spray, but my God, this ain't he ain't the one that did this work. But just look. He did none of that stuff, right? Look right here, y'all. Camera probably don't pick this up well, but just check this out. Look at this shit, man. Y'all cheat, y'all, y'all catching this shit? Check it out. Look all up in there. No paint in there, man. Look, look at all that shit. And I had the grill off and he still didn't get paint in there. Paint chipping already. Paint chip right there. Y'all seeing this shit? Follow me, Box Chevy family. Follow me, man. Look. Look how you got paint all on here and shit, man. Look at the size. This dude was horrible with it, man. Right? And then he, he barely sanded it. Like all the dents and things that was in there before I brought it to him, they still in here. Let me see. You can't really see this one, but it's a small ding right there. The camera probably not picking it up. Oh, let me show you on this side before I get off the front. He didn't take the lights or nothing out. He just, and I'm buying all this stuff new. These bezels, I'm getting all this stuff brand new. But look at this shit, man. Look at that. Look at this. Look, see how blotchy it is? Look what he did. Paint job from hell, right? Let's keep going, though. So we get to this side of the car, right? And you can just instantly see problems. Look. Boom. No paint there, right? Go along the thing. Boom, it's fucked up. And I'm going to show you all the other side, too. He got paint all on my chrome. Look, all over the chrome, right? He didn't take none of this stuff off, right? Okay, boom. Look at the mirrors. Didn't get no paint inside of the mirrors. You know what I'm talking about? This shit is horrible. Look. He didn't bother to remove none of the door strips, man. Look, the weather stripping, he didn't remove none of it. I just removed it, look. Paint all, he missed all of those spots, man. Look at that shit. Look at that shit. Door jams, I told him to make sure the door jams look good, especially, right? Look at the door jams. Painted all this shit, the boot, the rubber boot, everything. Look at the door jams, man. Nothing. He didn't even bother to pull the carpet back. Look, look at this shit, man. Is y'all following me? Look at this shit, right? Didn't pull the opera lights off. That only take three screws. It's literally one, two, and then a one little screw under there to get the opera lights off. He didn't even do that. Look, that was where the top was covering up. Look, no paint there. Y'all follow me on this shit, man? This shit is horrible, right? Back door jams, horrible. Same way. Look, look how it look. Look, man, it's like he painted over a bunch of dust or something. Just look at this shit. Look at this shit, man. And he wonder why I ain't sent none of my people to him. Look at this shit, man. I can't make this shit up, y'all. This is why Erlene is being repainted. I would not accept the bullshit. I wasn't going to even show y'all this shit. Look, no paint nowhere, man. I wasn't going to show y'all this shit, but I'm like, fuck it. But like I said earlier, you get what you pay for. Let me show y'all the trunk. I'm about to probably put some light on up in here. But look. Oh, man. Look at this shit. 
Y'all really can't see it good. He didn't put no clear in there, nothing. Look, look, man. Look at this shit. We getting all this shit redone, by the way. We getting this shit done the right way this time, man. Look. Look at that shit, man. Look, look. Look, man. I don't know if that's a chemical reaction or what. Look at that shit. Now, this was shit I did just walking past the car. I didn't give a fuck, though, because it wasn't painted right. But look at this shit, man. Just keep looking. This shit is horrible, man. He didn't bother to put no clear in there. None. He didn't even paint the deck lid. Look. Look right here. He barely got paint there, man. He did He did a shitty job. Well, follow me. Keep following me. And we get on this side, right? Look. Just look all in there, man. Look, there's still all the shit from the paint. Compound all in there. Just look at this shit. I can't make this shit up, people. This paint job is shitty. Look. No paint there. No paint there. He missed a lot of spots on this cart, right? But then when I got it back, this part was peeling already. This part was already peeling. The day I brought the car home, it was peeling, right? Look at that mirror. No paint there. You could at least took the mirrors off, right? Look at this shit, man. This is why my car need to be repainted. Look at this shit. I'm telling y'all now, man. Y'all know I get a lot of business for people, man, through my page, but everybody who asks me about who paints your car, I told him it ain't all what it's cracked up to be. I kept it 100 with him, look. He got paint over all my trim. Look how he's painting all my trim. He even got the dash painted, look. Look at that shit, man. Look at that shit. You couldn't, you mean tell me he couldn't take these up to just paint under it, man? Come on now. You know, and like I said, I'm not doing this shit to slander nobody. I'm just keeping it all the way above, though. This paint job is for hell. Look, man, even when the top was on, was no paint there, man. That's why I took the top off. So when we get it painted this time, we are gonna get this shit done the right way. Look at this shit. Look, look. Paint all on my chrome trim, man. Look at this shit. Y'all, y'all follow me, man. Look at this shit. I just want my people to see this shit, man. This he was. I was promised that he was gonna do all this shit the right way, man. But he let me down. Look, look, man. Look. No paint nowhere. You couldn't get paint in there, buddy. Look at this shit, man. Then back to that side. Look at that bullshit. So this is why I say this is a paint job from hell, man. One thing we ain't gonna do, we ain't gonna let one monkey stop a show. It might have cost me double. It might even cost me triple. But goddammit, we finna get this car right. One way or another. I done pushed it back up in the garage, man. But on top of this bullshit ass paint job, right? Dude kept lying to me about when he was gonna paint the car. I popped up on him. He told me the car was already painted. I popped up on him. The car wasn't even painted. He gonna tell me, oh, I seen a spot. So I took all the paint back off. I told him, I said, fam, do I look like a little kid or something that you can just tell anything, fam? You ain't finna take all the paint back off the car just to fix one spot on the door. Oh, it was a spot on the door right here. You see this little spot? I took all the, um, I took all the paint back off because it was a spot there and the motherfucker was still in primer when I got like, fam, stop it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I really got on his ass when I got up in there. You know, I had to pop up on him on some aggressive shit. But anyways, and I was trying to be patient. You know, I'm a good businessman, but when you start playing with me and my shit and my money involved, then we're going to have some issues. And I'm a man before anything, so I'm not going to let you play with me like that. And I ain't one of them niggas you're going to just tell anything and I'm going to be quiet. If I feel anything different, I'm going to speak up about it. You know what I'm saying? But he lied about that. Then um, on top of that, he going to tell me, oh, I put four coats of candy on here. This car blotchy as hell. Like, y'all can't see it on pictures or up close. Like, if y'all go look at that video when I was at the dealership, the Chevy dealership, like, riding around, you can see how thin this paint is. Like, up close, it looked thick. But from a distance, it's super blotchy because he only put one coat of paint on here. He put the silver base under here, but he only put one coat of candy on here, and that's why it's so blotchy. And, you know, that's the fucked up thing about these painters now because they so lazy that they don't want to do the work. If you don't want to do the work, just let me know that. If he didn't let me know he's going to do a half-ass job, I would I just said, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Which ain't nobody going to tell you they're going to fuck your car up. You know, but they want to keep the lights on, so they're going to keep on taking cars, man. There's people that have been still contacting me to this day. Like, man, dude been playing with all type of people, man. And, and now he's talking about he's going to be done painting because, you know, people been getting on his ass. But this shit is unacceptable, man. He put one coat of paint on here, probably one clear, maybe two. This shit, this is, like I said, this is one of the worst paint jobs I ever had. You know what I'm saying? So, 
it's all good though. It's like I said, it's water under the bridge now. We finna put it in the right hands and we finna get it right. Like I said, I don't expect my car to be perfect, but goddamn it, it's gonna have to be right, man. You know what I'm saying? Dude lying, I'm out of town, I'm this, I'm that. Dude was all over the place with this shit. And I had a lot of red flags pop up. But then by the time I thought about it, it was too late. I already had gave my deposit and all that shit. I'm like, oh, you know what I mean? So it was just too much. So we gonna get it right though, man. Like I said, this video ain't to slander nobody. It's just to keep it 100. And that's all I can do. I kept it 100. If he'd have did a damn good job, it'd have been cool. If he'd have said, oh, well, I messed up on this or this spot wasn't right, or, I can accept that. But you bullshitting me and then giving me a shitty paint job on that, it's horrible, man. And like I said, this paint job is blotchy. Watch some of my videos from the summertime when I was driving and y'all look at it from a distance. The farther back you get, the more blotchy this paint get, man. And I'm a solid dude. You know, I ain't gonna come short on your money. None of that. So I expect the same in return, man. You to come with some solid business. But it's all good. It is what it is. I ain't gonna trip on it. I just thought I'd share that with y'all, man. I'm pretty sure some other people can relate to this. You know, somebody fucking your car up. But it is what it is. You got to just find somebody who you can trust. And which is hard to do these days. But, uh... We gonna keep it pushing. Ain't one monkey ain't gonna stop no show. But that's it for this video. I'm gonna catch y'all on the next one. I got work to do. Box Chevy P checking out. If you're here just watching this video, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button because you don't want to miss this update because they coming back to back. Like I told you, when y'all see this makeover, it's gonna be on. Give me three months tops. Motor gonna be in running and interior gonna be in. Mark my words. We out.